Okay, Lawrence talked about a stretching video. This is a stretching video that you should be doing every day. Improve speed, agility, and you're less likely to get injured. So this would be the first stretch. And let's see, Lawrence, try to have a 15 count, a quick 15 count. Ready? Go. Make sure you breathe slowly. Okay, next stretch. Pick a side. Try to keep your legs straight. Try to breathe slowly. See if you can put your chest down to your thigh. Next stretch, other side. Exhale slowly. Try to keep your knee down. Some people are more flexible than others, but you could still get better. This is the hurdler stretch. Proceed. Breathe slowly. It's important to pull the toes back so you can get a good Achilles stretch. Flexible ankles help you with speed. Other side. Breathe. Grab the toes, pull them back, stretch the Achilles. This is a really good piriformis stretch. Piriformis is kind of like the glute, it's like underneath the glute. Let's see if you can do it. There we go. Piriformis stretch. Try to relax your face. Other side, piriformis, also attaches to your lower back and kind of loosens the back up. Very, very, very important. Pull your knee to your chest. Interlock your hands. There you go. Crossover stretch, just lower back. It's very, very important to do. You pull your knee higher. Right Other side, get your knee higher. Stretch that back. This is a super, super stretch. They do this in McKenzie if you like blow your back out. This is uh, keep your hips down on the ground, press up and breathe. Press all the way up if you can, breathe, exhale, exhale, relax your face. Really good for your back. One more time. Breathe, 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 breathe. Okay, this is a downward dog for the Achilles. Go. That's the calf. The Achilles would be if the knees are bent. Yes, he bends the knee, and that's the Achilles stretch. Other side. Straight leg for the calf, bent knee for the Achilles. This would be the hip flexor stretch. Just sink into your front leg. Reach up with the hand that's down, with the knee that's down. Other side. Sink into the front leg. Reach up with that hand. Breathe. Reach up. Yes. That gets that psoas, which is that muscle, that abdominal muscle also. He likes the name. Should be the last stretch, and that would be the quadricep. Very important for young, growing kids.
other side. Just try to stand up straight. There, push your hip out. These stretches should be done every day before you go to sleep. And you will be a better athlete. You want to say a couple words? Uh, yes. These stretches are not just before you go to sleep. I usually use them before I uh, get into training, before I do batting practice, before I play catch. This is very important if you want to get really healthy and strong in your muscles. So you should take this on and off the field.